Hey, and welcome to this week's Tech News. So this week, we are broadcasting here directly from Intel Vision 2024. Uh, it's been an electrifying event packed with groundbreaking announcements. Uh, among them this morning, the unveiling on the Intel Gaudi 3 hailed to be the most currently powerful AI processor in the world. So very exciting process. Now let's dive in this week's news. Um, first of all, Apple explores robots personal robots. Secondly, a huge future data center uh, on the horizon. The salary battle for AI engineers, then AI data sources hit copyright barriers. AI gets smarter than humans by 2025. So let's start by Apple that is exploring uh, personal robots. We all know the size and strength of Apple, but it has been unsure of the role it's going to play in the area of robotics. That may be changing with Apple's AI and Huawei teams developing a mobile robot that can navigate homes equipped with advanced AI and culture environments. This is a talk of it being able to do the dishes, clean surfaces, do the chores that you can imagine. They obviously do uh, see opportunities in the smart home sector following the release of the mixed reality headset a few months ago. Whether these innovations will reach consumers remains uncertain, and it comes on the back of Apple's recent pivot away from the electric car that we've seen. The real challenge is that it seems like these products are years away from being released, uh, and we've covered other tech companies that seem a bit closer than Apple on this project. Let's talk now about the huge future data centers at Bloomberg AI Summit. Co-with co-founder Brian Ventura uh, sounded the alarm on the rapidly growing demand for data centers propelled by AI search. And they are not alone. Uh, with every tech company facing the same issues, Ventura revealed Co-with's staggering daily data center requests, signaling pressing need for, in, for expensive infrastructure. He anticipates a sprint towards constructing data center mega campuses, uh, demanding substantial capital investment as uh, Amazon, Google, or, or Microsoft. However, Europe faces space constraints, exacerbating the strain of data center expansion. Data centers may not be the most sexiest side of AI, but without the infrastructure they need, the AI revolution will slow down. So. That means bigger footprints, bigger energy requirement, bigger connectivity, uh, as well as people to run all this. Let's talk now about the salary battle for AI engineers. The inevitable talent war for AI engineers has broken out. Uh, Tesla is raising salaries to stop talent being poached by companies like OpenAI, as OpenAI actively targets Tesla staff. Uh, Elon Musk described the battle for AI talents as the craziest he's ever seen. The AI talent race has seen compensation packages soar to over 1 million annually, with OpenAI offering median salaries of more than 900,000, according to levels.fi. Uh, data. Employers, including Tesla, are willing to hike salary to up to 44% to accelerate and keep those talents in hold. None of this is a surprise, but the big question is how quickly the market can start training enough people with the right skills to meet the demands, or whether the skills shortage will become another bottleneck challenge to AI's growth in the future. AI sources hit copyright barriers. That's another key news of this week. All the AI models are trained using vast amount of data, where that data comes from, where this data is, is coming from is uh, an issue and more and more an issue. The New York Times alleged questionable practices employed by OpenAI, Google, and Meta in training their AI models, raising ethical concerns in the AI community. Reports indicate the use of copyrighted works and YouTube video transcripts to fuel AI development, highlighting challenges uh, in sourcing high-quality de training data. OpenAI's utilization of its whisper speech recognition tool to transcribe vast amount of YouTube content, despite legal and ethical uncertainties, has drawn scrutiny. All the while, the platforms are doing deals 
with the likes of Reddit, Quora to buy access to this content, uh, Google's discrete alteration of policy language to expand data usage, and Meta's reconsideration of co copyright infringement for AI training underscores the industry's complex ethical landscape. So like most other challenges in the AI world, this won't be solved quickly and will determine how fast AI can really evolve. Last news for this week, AI gets smarter than humans by 2025. This is what Elon Musk recently shared in his bold prediction about artificial intelligence. He talked about AI surpassing human intellect within one or two years. By 2025, Musk believes AI collective intelligence may be bigger than that of humanity. Interestingly, he's also worried about challenges such as AI being programmed for political connect correctness, the issue of electricity availability, and the need for swift regulatory framework to keep pace with the AI's rapid progress. While we all know that Elon Musk is driving forward with Grok, he's always talking about the real and challenging issues that are surrounding AI, and it's all in our society urging us to navigate this transformative era, era with foresight and responsibility. Thanks for following, and I'll see you next week.